worked with uh, sensory systems, hearing and smelling and also seeing and uh, the methods they are behind it. Eyes are very complex if you look at seeing at vision itself. It's a real uh, complex story. Um, every animal has its own vision. Not every animal sees the same. Some see colors, some do not. It begins in photoreceptor cell and uh, it's the best, I think, the best cell known in science uh, with this whole signal transduction cascade. Um, the inner segment where the nucleus is also and the whole uh, production of the proteins, um, they have to move uh, to the outer segments where this tra signal transduction takes place. And the only um, intracellular connection between these parts or compartments of the cell is uh, connecting cilium. We are working on a protein uh, which is discovered first uh, in a, a disease, it's a polydactylist disease and involved in dwarfism. Uh, it's a dwarfism disease also and um, we know uh, that this protein is involved in uh, mitosis, uh, in cell division, but also in, uh, it's located at connecting or at, at cilia itself. We just have to know where this protein interacts with other proteins. Imaging is very important in um, different parts of our lab, especially on protein level for uh, Western blotting or protein gels, is very uh, important for us because we are interested in, in our proteins in the retina, especially on different stages of development of the mouse, and we have to quantify them and to measure different proteins in the same extract, in the same experiments. Um, is the protein there? Is the splice variant there? How much is it, is, is it expressed or is it not? One of the problems we have is to quantificate uh, um, proteins on perhaps different stage of development of the retina. I like about this new Shimidoc MP system uh, that we have these multiplex features with uh, several colors, about up to three colors. We can uh, quantificate it quite easier because we can uh, use several up to antibodies, uh, up to three antibodies, one for the protein of interest and the other two perhaps for uh, uh, quantification protein, which is expressed uh, in the whole retina. So the real good thing on this system is I can take my one blood I got out of this one animal and I can show all the proteins I'm interested in in one lane. In the field of vision, you, you, we're working with a lot of animals and we have to, to think about a, a lot of different kinds of vision, going from the very basic vision of plain white light to this bright color vision a monkey or a human being uh, can do. And so I guess it's a little bit alike with these instruments. Just measuring black and white, you just can measure one color. And now this new Kimidoc MP evolved this kind of color vision, this imaging uh, possibility to image these different colors is anyway a great step in evolution. So we think that the Shemidoc MP system would allow us more uh, or deeper uh, look inside the expression patterns of proteins, perhaps in developing retina, retina to uh, get more look inside in these human diseases. <laughs>